Hey, Shalawa and Malkim, this is Yahweh Tazah coming back with another video. I want to give all praises and glory and honor to Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. Double honor to the elders of Great Millstone. Much love and respect to you brothers out there doing the work on sincerity and truth. Seeking out your own salvation with fear and trembling, striving for the hopeful elect and endearing all afflictions. Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai Waha, Rakat Kodash, Barakatam Akim. All right, um, basically this video is about all the brothers that are popping up to the four corners of the earth, you know, you know, more and more one man camps or what uh, you know a brother out there preaching the word is popping up man you know uh more and more you're seeing uh as i said brothers out there you know either either one two or three brothers pushing the word which is uh according to prophecy okay and the fruit that uh is spoken of in the book of matthew and it says that and your and your fruit shall remain in the book of john um is is referring to those that not only that are coming into the the fold as far as them physically there with them in the and you know on the highways and the byways but those that are uh, watching their videos man all right you you may not see them but they're there okay you gotta have faith in that so the uh, you know as as always I always make videos regarding brothers out there you know that are one deep you know by themselves because I I also am out here by myself basically you know what I'm saying the other brother uh brother Izar. In Millen, Texas, he's there, and he's, you know, he's basically, you know, one man too. But with me and him combined, where there's two men. But uh, you know, I make videos about brothers out there, you know, exhorting, admonishing, encouraging them to continue in the faith. But this is prophecy, man. You know what I'm saying? It's, it, just because um, you don't have a lot of brothers with you doesn't mean the Lord ain't dealing with you. Okay, the Lord is dealing with you, and that's a heavy spirit. And now, and and that's what uh, was once told unto me, and another brother that used to be with me, and it is—it's very true, you know what I'm saying? You you're standing up against a, a, a whole country or a whole uh, city or town by yourself, man. But really, you're not alone. Yahweh Shai and the angels are with you, okay? The Holy Spirit. But I want to bring out real quick Ezekiel 11 and 16. It says, "Therefore, say thus saith Yahweh, although I have cast them far off from." Far off among the heathen And although I have scattered them among the countries Yet will I be to them As a little sanctuary In the countries where, where they shall come You see So um, is as, as a little sanctuary with you man You know Though you're there alone you're by yourself is, is, is You're in safety You know There's a small sanctuary Okay you're You're, you're, in, uh, you're protected all right, you have to have faith and believe in that, you know, because we're all scattered through the four corners of the earth. That's why you're seeing brothers popping up everywhere, you know, especially the Latin tribes. You know, the Latin tribes are waking up over here, the uh, uh, south of the border, you know, Mexico, um, you know, Peru, Bolivia, uh, South America, okay, and 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 these these brothers, these men, are out there by themselves, man. Pushing the word. All right, you got the brother in Costa Rica. You know he Costa Rica. He's over there doing his thing too, through, through the spirit and power. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. And that brother right there, the, from the brother from Costa Rica, is 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 very diligent. You know, so he scattered us amongst the heathen, uh, uh, um, among the countries. But he, but he says, yet will I be to them as a little sanctuary in the countries where they shall come. You know. You're one man out there, man. Hey, that Yahweh Shah has everything set up the way he needs it, needs to have it. Okay, just keep doing your part, cause every man has their own, has his own lot, man. Okay. Judah rose up first. Judah's bringing out the truth. Now, now we're all waking up little by little, man. The Northern Kingdom. Okay. So keep in mind of that, man. You're a little Yahweh Shah is a little sanctuary with you there. You know, he's supping with you. You know. He ain't left you comfortless. Okay. Let's go over here to the book of Jeremiah 3. And start at verse. Let's see. Salakia. Jeremiah 3. And verse 15. Or Salakia. Verse 14. Turn, O backsliding children, saith Yahweh. For I am married unto you. And I will take you one 
of a city and two of a family and I will bring you to Zion. You see that, man? So he's bringing back those that he, he, he was married to. You know? Whether you want to accept it or not, eventually you're going to have to accept it, man. And you're going to do it willingly. You see? So it says, for I am married unto you. That's why he's seeing one brother coming out of a city, man. But that don't mean that you don't have fruit because your people are watching your videos, man. And they're believing by 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 Yahweh Shai working through you. You have fruit. You just gotta have you gotta have faith. You know? You gotta believe that people are listening to you. People are, are actually considering the message that you're conveying via the internet. Or even within your, your very own city, man. Just because they ain't stopping or asking, they see you, man, and they they, they, they admire that. You know? They believe in that and what you said. And that's that and and, and, and it's gonna be up to you how shy if that man's gonna be marked to, to be delivered. Alright? But like it said in Jeremiah three and fourteen, turn O backsliding children, saith Yahweh, for I am married unto you, and I will take you one of a city and two of a family, and I will bring you to Zion, man. You see that? That's that little sanctuary, man. So you brothers over there in Costa Rica, Bol Bolivia, Peru. You know, hey man, Yahweh is with you, and I and I believe and have faith that Yahweh is with me, me and the other brother Izar, okay, and may Yahweh Yahweh increase that brother, increase you brothers out there, man, that are by them by yourselves, but really you're not by yourself, and you can't be saying, "Oh, well, I'm by myself," because Yahweh is with you, Yahweh, well, Yahweh Shai, the angels, all right, then you, you got the brothers, you got the internet, okay. So that's the proof, man, that you're fulfilling prophecy, you know, just because you see other brothers camps here in the United States with, with X amount of brothers, that doesn't mean that you're not part of that fold. Yahweh Shai has things set up and you'll be surprised how, how great, you know, what, what, what I've been talking about, man, is the, it's the small things that give people they can even get they the small things can e either make 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 a a, a a big problem or it can make something that small thing that small generous thing can can make a big impact on someone's life or a relationship just that small just gesture you know what I'm saying like it, it, the small things is what what is what makes a big impact you know, yeah, yes, you know, people want to see numbers, they want to see big numbers, they want to see a lot of men, and, and, and but when they see that one person, that has a bigger impact from what I believe in, okay, from what I've experienced and what I, I see, whether it comes through working or, you know, a, a mechanical issue, electrical issue, a, 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 a fishing, well, even the Bible speaks about it, how... The tongue is a small member, but it causes a, a great, uh, you know, fire, arguments, you know. But the small, the small member also can bring life, according to the Book of Proverbs. Uh, it, the scriptures talk about a bit being in the, in the horse's mouth, but that small bit controls that whole horse, man. Or uh, or the uh, helm that's upon the uh, the boat that controls the the, the, the blade. Right, the, the 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 propeller, that's a small little uh, part, but it controls that big ship, that big boat, man. It's the small things that make a big impact on the people. You gotta have faith and believe in that, man. You know what I'm saying? So when it says in verse 15, and I will give you pastors according to my heart, which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding, and that's what you're doing, man. You have to believe and have faith in that. That you are a pastor, that you are a preacher, that you're a prophet, that you're a teacher. All right, but you're gonna go from level to level, and every brother has his own office. Okay, but you're gonna feed either way, knowledge and understanding. You're gonna give that to those. All right, but you, of that city, could only be the one that's gonna be delivered, man. You know, out of like in my city, there's a, over a hundred thousand people, and I know there's people in there that believe because I already encountered certain ones, but. 
from what I'm saying is that that can be like a fraction. You know what I'm saying? It can be three three people, but really in the eyes of Yahweh Shem El Shai, it's one. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know if that makes sense. But either way, you could be the, the one and only person that's going to be delivered within that city or town. All right? Because we know that Yahweh Shem El Shai is only coming back for a small remnant. Okay? So... In due time, if, if the Lord will, He's going to increase you. He'll give you a brother. He'll give you a helper. You know, He'll give you someone to help aid you, and vice versa. But until then, you're that you're that uh, that great shining light that standeth upon a hilltop, man. So utilize that, push forth His word, His wisdom, laws, and understanding, man. Okay, because we're living in the last days, and we got to do everything that we can to put on as the hopeful elect. So like I said, I made this video for you brothers out there because as you, you see the days go more and more, you see one-man camps popping up more and more, man. Okay, so with that, hope it was edifying.